you also guys yeah so let's deep dive now so map your mind that's what this project is talking about it's talking about my map your mind now when we talk about my map your mind it's all about you your personal way you or your profession the way you do business personal your mind your thinking faculty your ideology now this project need to follow this concept this closure and white problem i know when you guys open these things you guys will overwhelm my body and diagram all of these you guys will overwhelm all of that but everything is simple so all i'll do is that i'll focus on the one that is important because they will leave these documents and all of this. Most of them are not really important to this project. Or you can also do all of these things. I need to have. So, the whiteboarding and all of this. How to think like a programmer. What is piece code? Why and um, what is an algorithm? How to write piece of code? The life experience of piece of code and all of that. So, everything so before then i will come here and i will some few things already already in the sequence of instructions used in solving issues this sequence of instructions used in solving issues first of all this is a simpler version of programmatic OM of uh, it's supposed to be that uh, okay, okay, sorry, like that. This is a simpler version of a programming code in plain English. Like, you will try to write a code or you're writing it plain English so that you can understand or a new man can understand. Why closure? Closure, this is a diam- diagrammatic way of, way of solving issues before coding. This is this monster known as. So our uh, flow chart is the one we are using here. This is stats diagram, this is stats, this is input of output, this process, decision, and so this stats, if you want to write a flow chart, you have to post stats. Then we form in by those I don't know if it's going to be any step. So input of output means that input means bringing in something output means updating something process means you are doing something decision like making a decision should i do this should i do that you understand why put and talk means you should talk now let's start with our first project now i said calculate the sum of square giving input of number so we said we should calculate the sum of square giving input or the number. So what I'll do here is just to make a line. Yeah, that's fine. Right. So now let me write solution here. So I just make a full line. So, so let me do it for the last. This solution here, we need to come to that solution. Now, we say, let's see what we said here. According to some of square of giving input or number, create an algorithm in flow chart. Now, we want to create a flow chart and the first of all. So, what I'll do is I'll write flow chart here. So now we will push out in the oak. Oh, yeah, so many is trying the first tool. Now Easy. So let's write the first code first. So the first code is more easier. So if you write the first code first, we need to understand what you do. So 
that so it's up to me and do and do it's up to me and it's up to me it's up to me it's up to me it's up to me Stop this at the world. Um, this is that. This is that. Stop what we will start. So, yeah. It's nice. So, start. Stop what we will start. This then twelve thousand then so we are after we start we are reading so twelve and um, something like this yeah so we are reading so we need all one yeah. So we really just show the same thing and include the number. I write the number here. Um, eight. I really need this model here. Oh, I just want to use this for you. Include the number and make it so white as well. And make it so kind of white. Yeah, include the number. And the other thing said, we will just duplicate this. So we will just put, uh, yeah, so let's copy this, paste it, and just put it here. And what, instead of print it, we now ask for it, or you can say print. So, Of inputs are always the output, and this baby is correct. Output. So I have output this number, or I can say print. I can say print that number, that particular number. Understand? Then you start again. Start. Then you zoom out. He said a particular number, look at the question he said. He said, um, calculate the sum of a given number. So they didn't give you the sum. So now I'm calculating the sum. Let's start giving number to the words number one. Oh, this is supposed to be number one. Let's start giving number to the words number one. You understand? Number one. So let's start giving number to the words called number one. Then what you do is what? You root the number one because of the user has already was giving you the number one. Let us have a computer. When they send you a number, you read the number. Then what you now what print it out. So that's the best work. That's the best answer for the step forward. The first one. So by then I'll do the second video for the second one to so, save our time. Bye bye. God bless.